friends, welcome to my channel Creative Art. I am Nilima and tell me what are you doing this summer? Because today I am going to make this beautiful mirror wall decor. Home decors make your home look beautiful but they also cost you a lot. So the most surprising thing about this beautiful mirror wall decor is its cost. Yes, it costed me in all just 360 rupees to make this beautiful wall decor. So friends, please give it a try. Make it yourself as I have shown you all the easy steps to make this beautiful mirror wall decor. And do subscribe my channel friends for more creative art painting videos. And do press the bell icon to get notifications for each video I post every week. So enjoy this DIY friends. Friends, let's quickly check out the materials which we are going to need for this DIY. First and most important, we are going to need a base. So this is a round cutted base which I have bought from a shop. It is a piece of hardboard. You can also use a round shaped cardboard. This is of 30 cm and with that, I'm going to use a 15 cm mirror. You can also use a more smaller size mirror if you want. And before starting this DIY, you have to already attach this kind of hooks so that you can hang your wall decor. So this is our base. So the next and most important materials are this kind of bamboo sticks. For this DIY, we are going to need five different sizes of bamboo sticks, but I have only got three here. Uh, this is size 30 centimeter, this is 25 centimeter, and this is 20 centimeter. And as we are going to need two more different sizes, so I have cut the bigger size in 27.5 centimeter and 22.5 centimeter so that we can get this kind of conical shape. Next, we are going to use a Fevi bond, which is very important to stick this bamboo sticks on our base and also to stick the glass on the base. And for measurements, friends, we are going to need a pencil, a compass, a scale and a protector. Okay, so these are all the things we are going to need for this DIY. Friends, I have given the list of materials in the description box below with their links from where you can also buy them. So please do check out the description box once before you start this DIY. And friends, for coloring, we are going to need black acrylic color, artist gold premium metallic color and a brush. And at the last, we are going to need a liquid varnish. You can also use a artist picture spray varnish. But for this DIY, I'm going to use liquid varnish. So let's start now. Here yeah, friends, this is our piece of ply and using a scale, you have to first of all take the measurement that what is the diameter of the board you are using. While buying itself, you can also know it from the purchaser. For example, this is a 30 centimeter board. So I have drawn a center line of 30 centimeter from here and then marking 15 centimeter, I have also drawn one more line. This is the crisscross line I have drawn the second line and then using a protector I'm measuring whether both the lines are at 90 degree and yes exactly I have drawn them 90 degree so this is the center of my circle which is final and now I'm sure about it so now I'm going to draw a few more lines So now to the measurements to note for this division I have made using the protector is done this is the first zero angle then then 22.5 then this is the 45 degree angle then again 67.5 degree angle and then 90 degree angle okay so in this way I have made these lines using the protector the first angle is 22.5 second 45 then 67.5 then 90 okay in this way you have to divide it then this is my mirror which i have to place exactly on the center of this plate for that i have measured the mirror and the radius of this mirror is 7.4 so i'm going to exactly place it on the center with the help of my compass i'll exactly measure 7.4 From the center, I'm going to draw a circle so that I can place my mirror exactly where I want it to be. Okay, so now it is marked. 
let me measure okay it perfectly fits here and I'm going to add a lot and lot of favicol glue so now I'm going to let it get dry in this way so till the mirror get thicked up and dried up we are going to measure our bamboo sticks. So friends, this time I have decided to make this pattern on our mirror decors which we are going to stick one by one on the plywood piece. So for that friends, you are going to need six different size of bamboo sticks. The center one which length is 30 cm, the next one is 27.5 cm, the next one is 25 cm, again 22.5 cm, 20 cm and 17.5 centimeter okay so the last one is optional one but friends when i tell you about like 27.5 or 22.5 or 17.5 size which are not available with this kind of sticks so what you have to do is you have to mark one stick take a perfect measurement then use a scissor or cutter or a plier to cut them into this kind of sizes so that you can make this kind of pattern for example i'm going to cut 22.5 centimeter i have already measured it with my longest center this is the center and I have already cut 22.5 centimeter measuring the center stick then I'm going to take the next stick which I want to cut in the same size then using a plier I'm going to place it exactly where the marking is and then cut the extra remaining part in this way and you're going to get one more different size of stick okay so you have to make as many as you need and then we are going to start now friends our small mirror has got sticked up very well with the base so now friends i'm going to start placing the sticks on the place so this is the largest stick of 30 centimeter and we are going to place it on the line which we have drawn in this way okay for that i'm going to use fabi bond and I'll directly place it where I want to place the stick apply it on the line first and then place the sticks exactly on the line hold it for few seconds so that it will get stick exactly on line we'll keep doing the same all around Okay, so now the first layer of sticks are placed. So we will let it get dry first. After the base part is colored, I'm going to show you in what sequence you have to place the sticks. First of all, you have to apply glue. Then place the sticks accordingly after a certain distance. Try to maintain a symmetric distance. Okay. So this is the design we want to make and when you have achieved the exact distance place the second layer of glue from above the sticks which is going to make this permanent apply glue in a lot quantity and let it settle down so friends the same sequence i'm going to repeat it and complete it all over the spots and then i will show you how does it looks okay so till now friends i have completed doing the half part now the next half part is remaining and i have almost finished my first tube of heavy bond so this is the second one after you have placed them in a proper sequence with equal distance you have to gently press them for a while so that it may stick on its place exactly how you have placed it and finally you have to place two layers of glue from top of it okay friends so in the same way i'm going to complete the rest of the part and then i will show you how does it looks okay so here friends i have finally completed sticking all the sticks on our base and this is how it looks so now i'm going to start coloring using golden color and this is how good and thick our golden metallic color is so using a paint brush i will slightly start coloring all the sticks as golden so friends in the same way i'm going to complete the coloring part and then finally i will show you how does it looks okay
so this is how our decor looks when the golden coloring is completed and i have placed one more layers of bamboo sticks but this time i have placed the biggest one which is of 20 centimeter in between 30 this is the 30 centimeter bamboo stick and 27 centimeter bamboo stick and this was the empty space between it so i have placed it here and the next size is 17 centimeter then 14 centimeter and finally 11 centimeter so this time there are four sticks in between this five and four sticks in between this five so now i'm going to show you how i'm going to place it so that it will provide a volume to the mirror decor so now friends first of all i'm going to use Fevi bond for home and industry this is the best glue i found for this project so i'm going to place it here in this way then place the stick hold it tightly and then one by one i'm going to place our sticks in this way and you have to hold them for few seconds so that they may stick on place In the next one now in the same way I'm going to place the next set let this part get dry first and only after that start placing the next sticks After placing the sticks, I have to hold them on place for some time at least so that they may get stick to their place. Placing a pen in between these two bamboo lines helps me to balance the sticks till they get dry naturally. So I'm going to do the same in this way itself. So now friends, this is how the second layer of bamboo sticks looks when we have completed placing them all on place. So this is how it looks. It has also given our mirror wall decor a volume. So now first of all, I'm going to color them as white because I have observed in my golden color that it looks much more brighter and better when the base is white. So I'm going to do the base which is the bamboo sticks color as white first. So I'll just quickly complete it and then show you how does it looks. okay? Now friends, I finally completed coloring the second layer of bamboo sticks as white color. Now I'm going to give it a coating of golden and this is how it will look then. I'm using here an antique gold shade. So in the same way friends, I'm going to complete the whole coloring part and then I will show you how does it looks, okay? So now friends, this is how our mirror decor looks when the whole golden coloring part is finally completed. The color is very bright and beautiful. Okay friends, so after coloring all the bamboo sticks as golden, it looks this beautiful and shiny. And to keep it this way, I'm going to put two coats of Liquitex professional high gloss varnish on it so that it may look this way glossy and smooth which will make this part to clean it easily. Now friends after completion of mirror you can see this edges really don't look good. Some of you may find it good in this way itself but I'm actually going to change it so here I'm going to use Shilpukar modeling clay. This is a air dry clay which I'm elongating. Okay, I'll, I'll do it in parts so that I may get a good nice finishing. I'll pour a little bit of Fevicol 
on the edge in this way and then place this elongated clay on the edge like this without losing the circular shape so now after applying the clay on place I'm going to press it to the edges and make it flat in this way using a tool I'm trying to give it a perfect round shape from the inside and then using the same tool I'm going to draw this kind of lines by scraping giving it a raw look well now it is finally completed and this is how the center part looks i have to clean it but i'll clean it when i will color this part so i will let this part get dry now till that let's place the mirrors before starting the decoration part friends let me tell you i have kept the second layer about 24 hours to get dry and only after that i have done the coloring part the white and after that the golden part okay and again i have then kept it for a day to let the whole thing get completely dry and strong so that we can place this size of glass pieces now using fabi bond i'm going to place this glass pieces on the edge this way you can also use glue gun if you want first place a tiny drop of fabi bond on the edge of the bamboo stick in this way and then place the mirror on the top and press it a little bit So in this way friends you have to place the mirrors. I'm going to show you once again. Place just one slight drop of fabi bond. And then place the mirror on top of it. So friends in the same way I'm going to do this part and then I'm going to apply the tiny ones on this edges and then I will show you how does it looks okay. So now friends I have finally completed placing all the mirrors and this is how it looks so I'll place it on wall. I have colored the clay part same as golden also applied varnish before placing the mirrors and this is how it looks so I will quickly place it on wall now. So friends, this is how our wall mirror decor looks when I have hang it on the wall. It gives a better look this way but it would have looked much more better if the background color is much dark like in grey shades or any other dark color. But this is the wall color I have. Now friends, I will tell you the total cost of the materials I have spent that is just 360 rupees. I have used just 3 packets of bamboo sticks, golden color, fevi bond, mirror and the base which whole costed me 360 rupees. And if you buy the same wall decor from shops it will at least cost you 5 to 6 thousand rupees. So friends please to go try make it yourself as this is one of my most beautiful wall decor creations. And tell me in the comments below friends how did you find this video and if you did like this video friends please to like share and subscribe my channel. Thank you for watching.